The crossbow appliance is used to correct overbites. It consists of two portions, one for the upper jaw and one for the lower jaw. They are connected by spring attachments to the upper molar teeth and a push rod attachment to the lower wire. The appliance works by pushing the top teeth back and the bottom teeth forward. In the beginning, this appliance can be difficult to get used to as it may cause irritations in the cheek and around the lips and affect the speech for around one week. Use wax on any area of the crossbow where it is irritating the cheeks or lips. The wax should be removed before eating or brushing. Canker X can be used on any area of the tissue where the crossbow is causing irritations. The Canker X is used by taking a Q-tip, using one end to dry the area, holding the cheek or lip out so that the area stays dry, and then using the other end of the Q-tip to apply the Canker X gel. Continue to hold the cheek or lip out to allow the gel to dry for 30 seconds. This will create a barrier or a film that will help the tissue to heal in that area. The crossbow will make talking a little tricky for a few days, especially when you pronounce words with S or T, like 33 or 66, because the area where your tongue would normally go to say those sounds now has an appliance in the way. After three or four days, you will notice that you are able to say these words better. You will also find that you make extra saliva with this appliance in your mouth. That's because your body thinks that there is food in your mouth and it creates extra saliva to help you digest your food. After a few hours or a day, your body will stop producing the extra saliva and you will find swallowing much easier. When you have your crossbow, you should brush your teeth three times a day for two whole minutes. The teeth in the appliance should always look nice and shiny and should be brushed in the following manner. Start on one side, sweep up and down a few times, then go to the next side. You may need to flip the springs up in order to get around the appliance. Care should be taken while wearing the appliance to minimize potential problems. Opening too wide, for example, can cause the push rods to come away from the spring. If this happens, it is possible to reinsert the push rod into the spring yourself. Simply open very wide, grab the spring with two fingers, and then grab the push rod with two fingers. Compress the spring and insert the rod into the spring. 